Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Marion. In today's video, I thought I would compare two pink powders, the Huda Beauty Easy Bake Loose Setting and Brightening Powder in Cherry Blossom Cake. And then I picked up the travel size of the Ultra Pink Powder from One Size Beauty. Um, I got this when I went and returned the pressed powder from Huda Beauty. Did a video on that, giving my opinion. I'll link it somewhere up here. Um, so I was like, you know what? Let's continue going down this rabbit hole of these pink powders and to, you know, compare. I really wanted to compare the Huda Beauty powder against the Danessa Myricks one, but they don't have it inside of Sephora. I'll have to order it online. So we're gonna try the next best thing, which is this powder. I already love the translucent powder from One Size Beauty. So I'm pretty sure this pink powder will, you know, do me some justice as well. So of course I have a full face of makeup on. So I just want to just only focus on brightening my under eye. So I have two clean powder puffs to use. I'm gonna use One Size Beauty on this side and then the Huda Beauty powder on this side. Now, I don't think this powder has a scent because I don't think the translucent one has a scent either, which that is a plus. This retails for $18. This is the mini size. I'll, I think the full size is either 32 or 34. Um, I'll list both prices for the Huda Beauty powder and the one size powder down below because I don't want to give y'all any wrong information. So this does not have a scent. So right off the bat, this one, I don't know if you can see it. The one size is definitely more pinker than the Huda Beauty one. So, hmm, I'm a little nervous. I know I say that all the time. This has definitely brightened my under eye, but I like it. I'm just gonna take this brush and just, so it can blend together since I already have a full face of makeup on. But I didn't even need a lot to go up under my under eye. Hmm. It doesn't, even though it's pink, pink, it doesn't come up pink. Okay, Patrick. Now, let's compare it. I'm gonna tap off right here. Honestly, I don't really see a, a difference. Both of them are great powders. Let me just, this one here, the Huda Beauty one is a little bit more airbrushed in my opinion, but so is the one size, honestly, even though the one size is more pink in the top, I don't really see a significant difference. Let me take a selfie and see if I can see. No, I cannot. I cannot tell the, any different. I'm gonna post the selfie right here so you can see for yourself. Okay. Okay, Patrick. He was like, you know what? I know what the girlies want. I know what the girlies need. I'm gonna give you options and his pink powder ultra pink powder I really like it I need the full size one now I see why it's always sold out in Sephora I need to check and see if it's available on Sephora's website and also get the Danessa Myricks one I am really enjoying having a bright under eye um, I just think that it's it you know kind of like lifts the face and really makes your um, 
whole makeup look look gorgeous um yeah so i can't say oh get this powder or this powder because both of them are good i just feel like if there's like a significant price difference then go with the more affordable option but if it's two to three dollar difference i just say try out the powders yourself and then make a decision but i'm constantly looking at my under eye up close and they're both good so i hope you enjoyed this you know video of me comparing these pink powders if you did please give it a big thumbs up do you have the huda beauty powder or the one size powder if so let me know what you think about it are you interested in getting it don't forget to subscribe hit the notification bell and as always thank you for watching Oh, 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 oh.